what is going on guys here we're back with another adventure quest video today we will be going over 10 of my subscribers slash twitter followers sets and i will be rating them one through ten so this is kind of like a reverse on rating your houses i figured it'd be fun it gives people a chance to show off their either sets they put together themselves or their favorite sets you buy lots of possibilities here but without further ado let's get right into the first one all right and first up on the list today we have Zaya. so there's two sets we'll be showing off today first one love the necrotic sword of doom i don't actually have it i have every other version of it though but uh it goes very well with this i'm pretty sure that's the i don't remember how to pronounce it but uh it's color custom i believe unless that's not the armor i'm thinking of and I'm being quite dumb Okay, yeah, I believe that's the same armor I'm talking Let me just show you the armor real quick. I believe it's the female version of this armor. Sorry, I just had to clarify that for my own sake. Either way, love the set. Love both of them. I actually prefer um, this one over the blue one, but I'm going to give them both the same rating, which is going to be a solid 9.5 out of 10. Um, I feel like I have to do some sort of like match ability to these things or else it's not fair. So, um, this one matches up real nicely. I feel like just the red on this Necrotic Sword of Doom is not matching up very well, but that could probably just be me. So, either way, take it or leave it. Thanks for showing us your set. All right, so we are into the next set from Crab. Thank you, sir. The Chrono Dragon Knight is very appealing already. I'm going to give you a 0.5 bonus for that. Uh, looks like we got skulls going on here. And I am actually really digging it. This is really cool. Sure it took forever to get all that stuff. So, being that one of the skulls has green eyes, I'm going to have to give you a 9.9 out of 10 get that red eye there and we'll be golden man thanks for entering all right so next set we got swarm x i i with a legion themed set i do like it a lot i've never actually seen that cape i was just wondering because it looks like there's like a cape and then the wing because i know that's not a part of the armor Either way, very dope. I like it. Doesn't match the set very well, but um, I guess the cane really adds to it. Looks like we've got a birthday paragon pet of some sort. Don't remember which one that is. But overall, I will give this one a 6.5 out of 10. I really like it. Okay. Next on the list, we got Delissa. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. I am awful at pronunciations. Looks like we got white and black. Yin and yang. I really like this. That katana is really dope. I've never actually seen that. If it's new, then that's probably why. Either way, I think everything matches up well. Even the eyes on the Vorbal Bunny and your necklace. All matches up very well. I like this a lot. I really like that navel too. That's one of my favorite navels. So I will be giving this a 9.9 .9 out of 10. I would give it a 10 out of 10, but everything about it is not what I'm looking for. I will give a 10 out of 10 when I find the perfect set. We'll be safe on that one. Either way, great set. Thank you for entering. Okie dokie, next one. I don't know how to pronounce your name. Kolf or Koif. <laughs> Either, uh, my bad. I'm awful. Like I said, either way. I love what you're going for here. Um, it's obviously very creative. I've never, I don't, I think those are matchups, but everything else about it is pretty put together, custom. I like it. I'm not much of a fan of the whole top hat thing. Um, those top hats, I do like the one that I wear a lot, the draconian one. Um, other than that, I'm not really a fan of the top hats. Um, you do have the color scheme going for you though, so that I like that a lot. 
uh, overall I'd give this one a 9 out of 10 I like it a lot but it's not really something I would wear and this is just me rating these of course so like don't take this as like overall I'm sure there's people that love this and would wear this every single day alright so next on the list is Isa with I want to say like a pirate slash like Viking kind of thing the leather straps really bring out this kind of Viking vibe I'm digging it though I'm cool with that I don't actually like I've never really seen anything I don't think I've ever seen this armor either way the camo and the leather straps look really dope I will give this one a solid 9.5 out of 10 it all matches up I like it a lot the only thing I don't really like is baggy pants and that sounds really weird but like 99% of the stuff I wear is like casual wear I don't really wear armor or like battle wear so like when it comes to casual stuff I'm really picky either way great set thank you for entering and let's move on all right Looks like the um, ninja armor I was talking about earlier is making a second appearance. If that's actually what this is. Either way, really dope. Love the hat. And the staff was one of those rare drops for some uh, Hikari's birthday, I believe. I don't remember. I was away at the time. Either way, I freaking love that staff. Um, color customs all matching up. Really like it. Uh, set is gonna be a 9.5 out of 10 for me the only reason 9.5 out of 10 like I said before uh, armors kind of battle wear stuff is okay in my book nothing I would wear personally that and there's just a lot of gray even though I wear mostly gray so I can't really talk can I all right well <laughs> let's move on thanks for entering all right Hana 567 with the dual necrotic sword of doom that is actually crazy the armor matches well with the helm and the pet you kind of got the same color range going there I like it once again I feel like the necrotic sword of doom just has that overbearing red that just kind of takes over if only that was like slightly darker that would match like a lot of different things either way I like the set it's uh like a schoolgirl type thing. Uh, don't know the vibe you were going for, but I dig it. Really cool. And you will receive a 9 out of 10. Thank you for entering. Forgive my pronunciations, but now we have Raysa. I hope I pronounced that right. If I did not, I am so very sorry. Either way, it looks like we got the Gravelin Doomfire mixed with that new hair from I want to say it's the Star Wars theme shop that just came out which is very dope and I see that evolved blood orb I actually almost missed that I don't know how but either way I really like the set all matches up um definitely gonna mm, 9.8 out of 10 there we go I was having a hard time deciding on if I the armor situation, but it's actually pretty nice looking armor. I would almost wear it if it were to styled similarly on the male version. If there is even a male version of that, I don't remember. I know there is like a, a Doom armor. Either way, thank you for entering and let's move on. And for the final one, we have Light. I hope I did not mess that one up either. I'm really gonna have to work on the pronunciations, but either way, we got this like schoolgirl vibe again, mixed with like. If anyone's ever watched like Avatar: The Last Airbender, I feel like the girl that turns into the moon. Don't remember her name. That's like the vibes I'm getting right now, mixed with like the whole school outfit. Either way, really like the colors. Gonna have to give this one. 9.9 .9 out of 10 amazing set thank you for entering all right we are back thank you all for watching uh this is definitely a first for me uh not very used to this 
uh, things will get more, I guess, in depth. I'll start making like rewards and stuff for doing these. Um, either way, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, it, and I'll see you all in the next one later.